What is up, fellow nerds, and welcome to Not Just Status Quo. Today, we will be doing an in focus on Contessa Allegra Valentina de Fontaine. Valentina Allegra de Fontaine. Actually, it's Contessa Valentina Allegra de Fontaine. I know it's hard, but I don't like to repeat myself. Okay, so let's get right into it. For those that don't know her, can it, well, let's just call her Val. Val is played by uh, Julia Louis Dreyfus from Seinfeld fame. Get out! And, and V. You let that unstable piece of human scaffolding into your house? And other shows. Uh, I think she's a fantastic actress. But um, she debuted on The Falcon and Winter Soldier um, episode five last week. And she all that character also goes by the name Madam Hydra. Uh, she first appeared in Nick Fury, Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. comic books. As a youth, she was a member of a European jet set and a citizen of Italy. And her parents were killed aiding an unspecified resistance movement. Sound familiar? A lot of comic book characters have their parents killed. Not wanting the deaths to be in vain, she entered a training program to become an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. When she was trained, she actually met Nick Fury on a helicarrier. And Fury, Fury made an offhanded comment about female agents and Contessa being a skilled markswoman and a martial artist, uh, threw Fury down with a, ju a judo throw. Fury was so impressed that the two became lovers. Uh, later on, she was assigned to be the S.H.I.E.L.D. liaison for the U.K. And it's such an interesting choice, uh, you know, by Kevin Feige and the MCU to choose this character to bring in because she has so many different levels. You know, she was S.H.I.E.L.D. She was actually, you know, Leviathan. She was part of Hydra. She was Madam Hydra. You know, at one point, they kind of retconned her parents to being Russian sleeper agents, and that kind of brought this out. So they can go a lot of different ways with this character, and it's going to be interesting to see how they weave her into the overall story of the MCU. We have many options. So Dave mentioned that Val here was originally played by Lisa Rinna in Nick Fury, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Very cool that uh, this character has already appeared in a Marvel property. Do you think the way that Julia Louis Dreyfus delivered that line? Well, so you can just call me Val, but don't call me Val. Just keep it in your head. Was a little shade at the Nick Fury Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. movie from 1998, which if you haven't seen it, go see it. It's terrible and totally worth a view. I think, I think you're absolutely right, Keith. Yeah, for real. And you know what? Your fellow nerds should honestly uh, do a breakdown and a review of that movie, too. Let us know in the comments if you think that that's something you'd like to see us. Uh, you know, put ourselves through. I now realize television has one major advantage over a live stage show. Uh -huh. What's that? A television you can turn off. <laughs> we also did a little bit of digging and we found out that this character was also supposed to appear in Black Widow, which was supposed to come out a little bit earlier, but due to the Nickelback tour, obviously couldn't. And this is how you remind me. So I can't wait to see how they incorporate her character. And I think maybe what Keith mentioned before with her being uh, a supposed Russian sleeper agent, I think uh, in the MCU at least, I have a feeling they're probably gonna go the route by maybe skipping ahead from the shield storyline where she's an agent of shield and though they may end up skipping right ahead to her being uh working with leviathan or a russian agent so we'll have to wait and see i think that's definitely a possibility since leviathan does have a lot of ties to the red room and as soon as we found out that she was going to appear in black widow that definitely could be the path they're going down they probably need a new secret evil group in the mcu because hydra's kind of fizzled out so it does look like with what we've been what we've been given the tidbits we've been given this is going to be leviathan and in secret evasion um a scroll agent posed as val in order to spy on nick fury and fury grew suspicious and actually killed the scroll and that revealed the invasion to Fury. So will this be setting up something like that? This is not a theory palooza, but hey, this is that character. Is she gonna go that way? Could be. Well, obviously the reality is that she's actually secretly Mephisto, Dave. If you would just look at all of the secret hidden Easter eggs uh, that's been laying all throughout 
all of the MCU, you would have noticed it. Mephisto! And I just want to add that she wasn't impersonating her once during a Secret Invasion. A scroll was actually impersonating her twice during the comic run of Secret Invasion. So what does this say? Scroll search is on. She's definitely a scroll. We're going to see it played out. And I think this is going to be the beginning of the Secret Invasion storyline for the MCU. But that's what we think. That's what we know about Contessa. What do you guys know? Did we miss anything? Please leave it in the comments below. And we'll see you next time on Not Your Status Quo.